poles. Um, should you take walking poles or should you not? Um, I um, walked half of the Camino Frances without walking poles and got shin splints. I got walking poles and it completely changed my journey after that. It spreads the weight a lot more evenly. It stops it all going through one knee and one, one hip and all the rest of it at one point. Um, and for me, they're a no-brainer now. Um, one of the most awkward things about walking poles is normally they sort of bend in half or they come down in three bits, but they're quite long. And you might not get away with putting them in your bag at the airport. Um, and also the weight of them sometimes as well. So these ones I did quite a lot of research this time. And these are these are black diamond. They're called Distance Carbon FLZ. Um, and basically um, they are a pole that comes in three parts. They fold down very small so you can put it in your rucksack. You see how big that is. It's no, no size at all really. Um, and all you do just to, just to straighten it out is you just pull it down and then you... Um, and then you just clip it um, with the little clip that comes out. And these are adjustable. So a lot of the lightweight ones aren't adjustable. You have to buy them at one size. But you, for me, you need to be able to adjust your poles. If you're going uphill, you want them shorter. If you're going downhill, you want them a little bit longer. Um, so having them adjustable is really, really good thing. And these are the lightest weight ones I could find that are adjustable. So these are 100 and, about 170 grams each, um, which is incredibly lightweight for the poles. Um, they do come with different tips. I've got the rubber tips on. You can get metal tips as well, but I tend to leave the rubber ones on. And they come with this little, um, I can't remember what they call it, basket or something. Um, and all that does is that helps when you, it helps if you're going through mud because it kind of stops the uh, stops the um, poles from sort of sinking in it too much. But also when you fold it up, it, um, it just knocks that in well together. And you've got this little Velcro bit that you put around the top just to hold them together in place, um, which just makes them really handy to, uh, to use. So check them out again, highly recommend taking them. These are lightweight, they fold down small and they're adjustable. They're the three, three things to look after, out for. Um, you might wanna look up different types of hand grip. This one's fine. Some of them do cork ones and things like that, but, um, but uh, yeah, this one just with the rubber is absolutely fine. Uh, works a treat. So uh, yeah. That's your poles, don't leave home without them.